Hey everybody, we got an early copy of Uncharted 3 before it's November 1st release date. It's legit. Oh yes. Is it good? So me and Jake are huge Uncharted fans, we've been playing since the first one, and this is no different. This is the... it's equally as amazing, it's fuck it. it's ten sets, times more Sets amazing. the bar way higher. Yeah. Game is a masterpiece, that everything looks beautiful, and it's... This is like, you know me, I'm all about like that little shit with the graphics, and this game just, just does, just, just, just fucking The smooth does. animations, the super high attention to detail, it's great. The one level in the mansion when it's up, it flames, and you can oh. see the wallpaper actually curls up and burns. Yeah, and things fall apart. This game oh is beautiful, and it plays as good as it looks. Oh yeah, definitely. The gameplay is really, really good. Um, not much has changed. The shooting feels a little bit different. A little bit I can't put my finger on what is different about it, but I'm just not as fluent in it as well with it as I was. I would have to say they, they adjusted something and it feels a little less tighter than the other ones, but oh, a, little a little less tighter than two, but it's still it's still great. It gets the job done. Oh yeah, it doesn't affect the game, like it doesn't af affect my opinion no. at all. Still, yeah, not at it's, just, all. it's just different. It's just something I have to get used to, which and which by the end of the game you do get used to it. Yeah, you don't even notice it. There is a huge emphasis on hand-to-hand -hand combat now. They totally upgraded it. You can fight more than one person at once. It's no Batman Arkham Asylum. But, but it's still very, very good. It's fun to watch. Now you can use the environment. You can fucking break a, a beer bottle over someone's head. I was fighting in a market and there was a, like a table where a guy was selling his fish. Slap a guy with a fish. I grabbed like a fish at this and just whacked him in the face. Really. Classic. Everything in this game is just over the top and just super cinematic. There will be times where <clears throat> It's a cutscene and it goes right into the game. Right you into don't the even know what you're playing. I'm just like, why is he standing there like an idiot? Oh. You gotta be playing. I'm supposed to be. Wake up and I play. I put the controller half the, down half the time and just Never. Like, enjoy it. You, haven't you realized you can't put the controller down with an Uncharted game? No, you just can't. I just wanna look. I just wanna look. There are parts in this game, without spoiling it, but there's. You, you thought the train mission in Uncharted 2 was awesome. When you play this, that, the train mission is like nothing compared to this. Have fun with the cargo plane mission. I mean, that's not spoiling anything. You've it's seen all it on the trailers, yeah. yeah. It's lot, seriously one of the lot best of moments. A lot of surprises. There's actually a, a huge surprise in just the second level. Well, the second, you know, chapter. Yes. Huge surprise, story-wise, and it's a lot of fun. Let's get into the story. Um, <laughs> it's, it's good. Yeah. It's good. It's good. It's just like any other Uncharted 3, you know. I mean, it's just like it's just like all the other third Uncharted <laughs> games. Uh, it's just like all the other Uncharted games. You want to get the, tr the treasure. You're against someone to do it. This person's fucking bad as shit. You're not. But they raise it up a little bit. This is very. It's very much about the relationship between Drake and Sully, which I love. I thought that was really cool. It really has the buddy relationship going on, and it really. You know, these characters you didn't know a lot about, no. now they're finally getting fleshed out, and I love the characters yes. more than I ever did. There are some moments in the game where I get very, like, like choked <laughs> up. Marlo is the perfect villain, so it's the, the best Uncharted villain so far. Because yeah, she's just, she seems so evil without seeming so evil. One thing, the puzzles are really, really, really hard. Yeah. Am I retarded? I don't know. I feel like they were so hard. Some of them were hard. There were times where I would be running around and I would accidentally stumble upon it after like 10 minutes. I texted him a few times like, like, did you get up to this yet? Like, That's the problem with like, having having a game before a release. It was a big problem because there's no FAQs. There's nowhere yeah. to help you. So we had to wing it. <laughs> we're winging it with this. Yeah. But the puzzles are really, really good. And there are a few that actually make you like really think. And it kind of makes me feel more like a treasure hunter. Like a... Like I'm actually yeah, part you, of the game. You feel a little game. smarter. You feel yeah, like I Indiana do. Jones. Like, oh, that's what it is. We don't have, really have a lot of gripes with the game. There's, uh, there's, there's one level early on. It, it takes place in Syria, and it takes place in like a museum castle. And uh, I just feel like it was poorly designed and kind of lame. And we yeah. both kind of we were playing it, and we got kind of worried. It was. But weird. then after that, the game got great. Yeah. So that's the only thing we. That's the only problem we really yeah. have. Other than that. I have zero problems. Sign me up for Uncharted yeah. 4 because this was great. Oh yeah. The multiplayer, we couldn't play it yet because it's not up, but we've been playing with the Subway promotion. Yeah, and we and also awesome. got to take place in it. We also got to take part in a multiplayer tournament. Oh yeah, and that, you In know, New York City, and that was a lot of fun. Multiplayer is a blast. I'm going to be playing it once it, actually, that too. Yeah, once it actually starts <clears> up and you know, gets going. I'm going to be hardcore into that. Also, real quick, for those of you who have watched our Batman Arkham City review, uh, for the giveaway, we're currently in the process of giving out Batman Beyond skins. We've gotten to some of you. We haven't made a video about it, but we're giving them out. 
We're trying to give you guys as much as we can, so uh, keep checking your inboxes. We didn't forget about you. And uh, so get playing Uncharted 3 multiplayer when it comes out. We already got our practice, oh, so yeah. we're going to be kicking your asses. So. We'll see you guys on there. Boom. Boom.